guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be doing a kind of like a back to school easy look something quick and something you're comfortable with and i remember when i was in school in high school um <laughs> i wouldn't really put a lot of products on my face i would never use um liquid foundation i would only put on like powder foundation but even like that i would put on very lightly i wouldn't go heavy on it and I would put on eyeshadow, but it was always something very neutral. I had a, like a little CoverGirl go-to palette. <laughs> like it's just a quad. I had a go-to CoverGirl quad. And I would only use like two of those colors. The mascara and I would always, always, always do my brows all the time. Like that's something I would never leave home with. Like I would always get to school already with my brows done. I wouldn't put blush on and my lip was always some type of balm like it was like a lip balm if I had to anything else besides a lip balm or a lip smacker or anything like that it would be like a lip gloss that wouldn't stick because I didn't like nothing sticky or heavy on my lips and that was really it maybe I'll go I'll do like a video that would like you know like show you how I did my makeup when I was in high school I already washed my face and I put my eyebrows obviously I'm gonna I didn't put anything on my skin I didn't put no moisturizer because um, I usually do heavy moisturizing at night but for my moisturizer during the day I use aloe and it's it's I like this because it's light like it doesn't do anything to my foundations that I use and I've noticed that with the uh, Moisturizers, the, the other moisturizers that I do have, they kind of come off kind of heavy and thick, and I don't like that. It looks ugly with my foundation, no matter what foundation I use, it comes off real cakey, or sometimes it it um it just looks gross, like almost like glue, like when glue peels, it looks ugly, and uh. This is something, I know it's not a great thing, but I like this on my skin. Like, I love the way it feels, it cools, and it really seeps into my skin. Um, that is usually what I mix into my my moisturizer, but it's still overall very thick, a thick consistency, so I'd rather you just use it at night. Um, I also go in with a setting spray, but I'm not going to go in with a setting spray this time. Uh, afterwards, I will. But today the foundation I'm going to be using is the Milani Conceal and Perfect 2-in-1 Foundation in 03, which is light beige. And today's a good day to wear it because it's not like melting hot outside. And one pump will literally just do justice. So yeah, I'm going to put that on there. I'm going to put that on with my finger, like just dot it all over my face. You see that I have red spots. <laughs> My face does have a bunch of like little red like spots. Which is irritating by the way. So I'm still trying to get my lighting right. Um, I really do prefer to use the outside light like natural lighting but just the way everything's placed in my room and even when I try to change everything it just doesn't work out that way. I don't know what else to do. And then to top off that I don't lately I haven't been having the time to record during the day at least not where the bright light is coming up from usually I end up recording like when the Sun's already going down and I have to kind of rush and midway through my videos like the Sun's down and I'm like totally doing everything in complete darkness and I hate the light from my room it's like yellow and I don't like it mm. How I live in an apartment where I'm really not allowed to do a lot to it. I'm gonna be going in with the LA Colors um, brow pencil, and it's in dark brown. It's called Brow Wowie brow pencil. It's their new brow pencil, which I'm I really love. So I'm going to go in with the Maybelline New York um, Concealer, Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. 
and 15 this is fair I have my other one but I'm almost finishing it and I don't want I don't want to finish it so I'm just gonna go in and fair and I know it's so light I know I usually use this to have a bright highlight right here how do you hide this you see like the actual indention of my dark circles my gosh I just I can't hide it Brow Precise Fiber Volumizer from Maybelline in medium brown. It's like a fiber mascara, but for your brows. Just adds a little bit of um, volume. <laughs> Which I do believe it works when you have already a product on your eyebrows. Alone, I don't think it does so much. Like you, There's not really a ginormous difference, you know. I'm gonna go in with this uh, Wet n Wild um, Trail palette called Walking on Eggshells. And I'm gonna go in with this bone color right there and put that on my brow bone. I'm going to be going in with a um, blending brush right here and I'm going to be using this crease shade right here I don't know what they're called it doesn't say the shadow names I'll be using that and put a little bit on my crease I'm not gonna go like overboard there's not gonna be like a very extravagant type of look like glam out there just something that will make you kind of look awake like put together uh, put it all over my crease not being precise either put like a little flick right here so can just give you like a little lift, sort of sagging your um, eye shape down, which is okay. And then I'm gonna go in with this eyelid color right there, and put that all over my lid. Just go in with that same dip a, one little tab and then just run it through your crease again. That brow brow bone color that we use, I'm just gonna use it for my inner corner as well. It has like a nice sheen to it. Go in with that crease shade that we use and just run it under your eye. Just slightly. Just like a thirds of your eye. Don't go all the way in. If you would like to wing this, you can also wing it. I'm using the Wet n Wild uh, color icon in fluorescent pink. Sorry, fluorescent pink. Finish off this lip with Wet n Wild and uh, Willow. 
just my favorite, one of my favorite eyeliners. Mm -mm. One of my favorite lip liners. I love it. So that is a finished look. I hope you guys really did enjoy that look. Um, I know it <laughs> took us a little bit longer than usual, but usually mine takes about an hour to just have everything completed. But this is something that could be very, it could be literally like toned down to the most minimum with just the eyes and the lips if you prefer. Um, but this is would be a good back to school type of look based on my opinion. Just something you're comfortable with would really do the job. But if you guys did like this video, please give this a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and please follow me on my other platforms like Twitter Instagram snapchat I'll have the links posted down below I would really really appreciate your feedback and please um, subscribe to my channel and ring uh, check that little like bell so you can be notified every time I upload a video and I will see you in my next one God bless you guys